15 people were arrested during last night's riot in downtown Portland. And several businesses in the process were damaged, especially along West Burnside. That includes a church that helps the homeless. Our Jacqueline Abad spoke with the pastor about how last night's vandalism is impacting those in need. Jacqueline. Dan Elizabeth will say Andre Bissett Church serves hundreds of homeless every week. They provide hygiene, food, and grocery bags, but now their hospitality services are postponed after someone smashed their windows. Now take a look at this surveillance video. This was around 7 o'clock last night. You can see someone dressed in black use a hammer to smash three of the windows. The person opens the door, but then continues to move along with the crowd. Today, the windows are boarded up, the shattered glass collected in a Bucket. Church services are also postponed, but the pastor will continue to do services on Facebook Live. Right now, the only damage that we have, which we're grateful for, um, is, however, the building is compromised because of, of this. And so, uh, unfortunately, um, the actions of this one individual has forced us to cease our outreach. So, as hundreds of people that we normally would give food to, um, we're not able to because I don't feel that my staff is safe. Restaurants and storefronts were also damaged near Southwest 10th and Harvey Milk. Many businesses are frustrated as they are trying to survive during this pandemic. Now, if you recognize the person in that surveillance video, contact Portland Police Central Precinct. Also, we have information on how you can help um, the church in this time of need. That information is on our website, coin.com. Today, I did speak with the pastor. He's asking people for prayers for peace in our streets. Reporting live, Jacqueline Abad, Coin 6 News. Jacqueline, thank you. Also